Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to just do a quick vlog before my mom comes home. Um, we are actually getting ready to go to tonight's Friday Night Lights, which is our what we call our football games here. And so, as you can see, I'm all spirited up for school. Um, and so we're actually versing some of my, my friends' schools. And, because they go to Panama. And so we're having what we call friendship war, and we are just kind of like going back and forth at each other. Like Panama did this, Spire did this, you know. He's, you know, he's gonna win type of thing tonight. And so I'm getting ready, and Jason's already at the band room. He had to be at the band room at like 5:15. So he's already there, and I'm just waiting for my mom to get off work. We're going to go grab a bite to eat, and then we're going to go to the football game, and we're going to go see who wins. Last time we beat Panama 56 to nothing, guys, but our team kind of sucks this year because we got a lot of freshmen that are playing on our varsity team, so we will just have to see how everything is working out. I'm kind of super excited for this game because, like, a lot of my friends go to Panama. But it's also, like, I feel like a traitor at the same time, guys, because, like, I'm going over to Panama's side for two quarters and I'm sitting on my home side for two quarters. So we'll just have to see. <laughs> um, I really am excited, though, because I haven't got to see Velta for a while. And... Or, like, more specifically, Velta. Like, you guys have, like, heard me talk a little bit about her in my videos. But I haven't got to see my Panama friends in a long time. Probably, I want to say since, not last Wednesday night, but the Wednesday before was the last time I got to see a bunch of them. But I have a lot of Panama friends that don't go to that church. So, I'm, like, overexcited. Um... Jason knows some of my friends from Panama, and so we're super excited to get to see them. He likes seeing Velta, or has he calls her Velveeta. Um, um, yeah, he was actually texting me earlier saying he was getting ready to go out on the field. Guys, like, I don't know where y'all live. Comment down where y'all live and tell me what the temperature is right now, because, like, it's like 40 freaking degrees right now. Like, that's the high. <laughs> that's been the high all day is 40 degrees. And I'm in Oklahoma. <laughs> so, it's 40 degrees here. And we're about to go sit for two plus hours at a football game. Yay. I hate cold weather, guys. As you guys know, I don't do cold weather, especially when it's 40 degrees. Like, we are literally bringing bringing blankets to wrap up in um but I go to every football game because I'm a football fanatic my mom is kind of a football fanatic she's more of the band fanatic I mean I love band too but you know either way it works out oh and guys look what I got I'm like super excited I got my softball stuff I got this is my glove it's a Rawlings glove and I'm, I'm like in love with it guys. I got a face mask because I wear glasses so it makes it easier not for things to hit me in the face. And then my helmet. It's just white because I didn't know like what if we were gonna like decorate them or something. And so I actually I bought the stuff later in the year because like right now they're not doing softball. But I'm um, probably, hopefully, going to try. But if I don't, then at least I have that stuff, you know, if someone wants to use it. Um, comment what sports you do, along with the where you live and your temperature. Um, so, yeah. Do y'all do, like, Friday night football where y'all live? Or, like, what is that? Is that, like, a thing? <laughs> um, I know some schools, they do, like, Thursday night football and stuff like that. Um... Yeah. So, I don't know. So, as you guys can see, 
I have my makeup on, and I'm just going to do a quick run-through of what I have on, and I'll kind of show you guys since my lighting is, like, kind of changing. Okay, so my perfume that I have on is Warm Vanilla Sugar. It's a Bath and Body Works fragrance, and it smells amazing. And this is, like, what I wear literally every day, guys, which is probably really, really sad. And then I have Tresemme, Tres 2 Spray, non-aerosol hairspray number 4 in my hair to hold my braids together. I have Claire's Red Lipstick on my cheeks because they don't have red eyeliner at the moment. And it looks like that. Well, I mean, it was longer, but I used a lot of it. Um, I think red is, like, one of the main colors I use a lot. And then I have NYX Roll On Shimmer, also on my, like, cheek line area here. Um, and it's in, like, this brown color. I have... NYX Retractable Crayon Eyeliner in White on my cheeks and on my nose. And I also have NYX Retractable Crayon Eyeliner in Black on my cheeks and along my eyebrow line. And so that's what I have on. Oh, and my lipstick. Yeah, I forgot to show you guys that. I have on... And the first one that I have on is Neutrogena Moisture Shine Gloss in the color Healthy Blush. Oh, yeah, and the shimmer color is called Walnut, guys, and it's N-O-I-X. And then the red color that's on my lips right now is called Vice Special Effects. It's by Urban Decay. And it's actually in the color Copycat. And I love this color. Just like, get a really good look at the color, guys. So we're actually going to put a little bit more on because I love the shimmer of this. Um, the top comes off really easy. And you just apply it. I like that. I don't know, really think, oh. For some reason, my bottom will stay on. But... My top won't. I've used this stuff a lot, so there's like barely any in here, so I've like tried to refrain from using it. But I got tired of wearing this because, in all honesty, this smudges a lot. Like, I got the Circus Mist and I was super excited to try it out because it was like their limited edition, but it smudges a lot. Like, whether you sweat, whether you talk, whether you eat, whatever you do, it's going to come off no matter what, and it stains. So, it won't come off. Like, I'll show you guys. I'm just gonna, like, set my camera right there for a moment, hopefully. There. Um, so, I'm just gonna put some of this on the back of my hand and show you guys. So, there's a big, nice strip on the back of my hand. So, we're going to let that dry for a minute. So, that's what it looks like. And just me waving it around, you can tell it's already started smudging. And then, this will be... Oh, I can't see. Okay. Guys, this will be periodically throughout the day. Like, if you do anything, that's going to turn out what it looks like. And it gets all over your clothes and everything. It's honestly, like, a big mess. And then, take makeup wipes to it, and it gets way worse, guys. Like, I'm not, like, trying to burn Claire's or anything. But their product, like, I wouldn't go out and buy this product ever again. So, I'm just warning you, like, don't buy it. Like, if you think it's a good product just take my word for it like I wear it right now on my face because like I don't know I don't it's okay on your face like it doesn't really do much but just kind of sit there 
but it's everything like else like your lips and stuff like guys that's just when I'm trying to take it off and honestly it looks a lot more pink than it does red if you can tell and so it gets on my nerves because like everybody's like oh it's such pretty pink lipstick you have on and it's like um it's not pink it's red and they're like what 